Hazza al Masnari, the first UAE astronaut, will be launched to space on September 25, 2019. The launch will be at 5.56 p.m. Dubai time. He will arrive after around six hours to the ISS. So at 12 midnight, they will be arriving to the ISS and they will be docking. And they will ha have to wait for another two hours for the hatch opening to happen. The hatch opening will happen at two in the morning and it will only happen after confirmation from the ground station team and from the other astronauts in the International Space Station that everything is safe and there is no leakage. And from that, Hazza al Masori and the astronaut, the US astronaut Jessica and Oleg from Russia will enter the ISS and they will start their scientific journey. Many of the missions uh, worldwide, when they start their missions, they start with eight days, short mission. And I can tell you that Hazza's mission is very packed with scientific experiments, uh, research, educational programs, and some communication with the students here and the public here on Earth. The microgravity and the exposure to the radiation and uh, the vacuum that is uh, in the um, space environment, or the harsh environment in space, uh, will definitely have an effect on uh, the human body. But uh, during the studies that will be conducted on uh, Haza al-Mansouri uh, in this mission, and from the previous studies, there are different uh, um, tests uh, been done on astronauts pre, during, and post the mission to uh, come with results uh, to, um, to have uh, evidence on uh, the effects. So basically there is a recovery uh, time for mm -hmm. astronauts after the missions. So uh, the recovery may um, differ from one astronaut to another, but uh, uh, luckily uh, all astronauts c uh, could recover after their missions. The International Space Station is a gateway for humanity for space exploration. Through Hazza, he will introduce to the people in the UAE, in the Arab region, people worldwide for the first time, uh, to many people for the first time, the importance of this experiment, how it will make a great change for our future, how it's important to study our human body, the different research, because things that happen on ISS in a microgravity environment is different than what happens here on Earth. So it's very important for the scientific community to do research here on Earth and to do it again in space and see the differences and learn from it and go from there. From there, we will have uh, unique results. Unique tests will be conducted on uh, Hazza that will give us evidences on the uh, studies that, uh, that are always conducted on uh, ISS. So uh, here we will know exactly if the environment or the person environment affects the results that we get from um, the space or in microgravity in general. I would like to invite everyone to watch the launch and learn all the details of how hard it is and how complicated this launch is. And uh, wish Hazza al-Mansouri and the other crew the best of luck on a successful mission. <laughs>